You don't really know much about Halloween. And welcome to another Sinister Snacks. I'm your host, Laura. I'm Joel. And we are here with a big little haul, I guess you could say, like with three different kinds of chips. We're going to do the flavor drops of the Lay's chips. So we're going to start off, I think, with honey butter. Which notoriously through, as history will tell you, we're not a fan of honey butter chips, but... We're going to try them. They had three new flavors, two of which we're excited about. And this one, we just have to try because we have to give you an honest opinion. So. Yes. And it, this is a uh, inspired by the tastes of Korea. So I think that that's a popular chip flavor. Kind of like the uh, onion, cheese and onion chips over in England, which who knows. Yeah. Down, if you'd like to find more of our content, uh, just yeah. check out the YouTube channel. There's Ooh. plenty of other stuff there to check out. And if you want to find out where you can find us in terms of uh, the art that we do, the events that we're at, our other shows that we do, uh, our podcast, as well as anything else Newly Duds related, just go to thenewlyduds.com for all of your Newly Duds needs. And uh, yeah, let's just dive right in. All right. Want to sniff it? Smells honey butterish. Honey butterish. You can have 15 chips for about 160 calories. I'm going to guess I'll have two Eight. to three and then I'll be done. Yes. This is for you, two, pod one. Mm. Overall, it's definitely a Lay's. Mm -hmm. They're very consistent with the type of chips they use and the way they cook them, etc. Some of the other ones we've had have been heavier on the honey. These are a little bit more of a lighter touch. Mm -hmm. Just um, like a sweet chip. The butter is, is there, but it's not like super pronounced. Mm -hmm. uh, all in all, I don't hate it, but I don't know that I would ever buy it intentionally. Right. Um, yeah. It's a decent chip. Yeah. If you like Lay's, you know, and you like sweet chips, I think that it might be right up your alley. I'm going to hand these to you. We're pretty hard on Lay's here on this channel. That's probably my fault. But, uh, yeah. So are we going to rate these all at the end or just as we go? Um, let's do them as we go. Okay. So um, for the Lay's honey butter chips. On a scale of 1 to 10. 1 to 10. I would give it a four. A four? I was thinking a three on those. Yeah. Not bad. <laughs> Incidentally, our dog just licked the tripod, so if it moved at all, yeah, that's, why. that's why. The next one is uh, also the Global Edition. Um, it is the Wavy Lays, which I always like them a little bit better. Tzatziki. Uh, inspired by Taste of Grease. Which we like. Tzatziki. And... It says thir 13 chips for 150 calories. Okay. Sounds about right. And I feel like we've Sorry had for the loud opening sound. I feel like we've had a flavor like this before and we've enjoyed it. It smells good. It smells very dilly. I'm getting a, a dilly sort of mm. thing happening. Yeah, they're a little bit bigger. Alright, cheers before you chew. Pot two. Hmm. Mm hmm You actually get that little bit of a like a brightness, yeah. You know that you get from from uh, tzatziki. I don't know how to say it right. You know that that thing. Tzatziki. Uh, what she said. Uh, I love a dilly kind of chip. It's true. Hmm. It's really consistent. So are the honey butter ones. As far as the flavor, yeah. Each chip, you know. Tastes like how it's supposed to. This one I could see, you know, buying unintentionally. I'm not a, a huge fan of the wavy ones myself, mm. but um, you know, as far as that goes, it's it's solid. You get the dill, you get the what else is in there? The yogurt, the yep, um, garlic, 
cucumber cucumber yeah it's got a real bright kind of deli flavor i like it yeah so um out of 10 on this one i would give it a nine wow i was gonna go a seven but i like it she she likes it a bit more than i do so mm -hmm. that's a win right there and the last one i hopefully i will like is masala because i love me some indian food so this is inspired by tastes of india we are we are both a fan of masala and i have high hopes for this one yeah this is the one you found first and then we found the second one later we've been waiting to do it this smells video. like masala uh and i feel like we had we had a masala burger not that long ago, yeah it was really was, good it was quite tasty i think that was trader joe's this one is 15 chips for 150 calories very this standard is, this is the winner that's the fit. Whoa. Yeah, that definitely has a... It's cumin, you know, kind of Indian flavor, kind of. That is a masala. Yeah. Smell. Yeah. Cheers to 42. Pot three. Huh. It's got a little bit of spice to it, as you would expect with a masala. Just, It's not too, too heavy, though, but... Uh-uh. I almost got, like... I know that this doesn't make sense with what kind of flavor profile you'd have, but I almost got like an eggy flavor, like that kind of mm. alamalak, that salty, you know. Yeah, like for some reason it mm. is hitting me. I like it a little more. I think I actually like the tzatziki ones better than these. I like it because I'm not big on like spicy, but it's I not. I love it. If you're not a spicy person, it's not like. You know, flame and hot spicy, but this is my jam. It is definitely a little bit more spicy than you know mayonnaise. Uh, <laughs> so, but it's it's good though. It's it's consistent. It's got definitely got the right flavors. Yep, every chip. Um, what they promised on it is what you're getting. So, out of ten on the masala chips, also a nine. This one I'm going to go a five only because, uh, like I said, the spice thing probably would be a little, little bit more than I would want to eat on the regular. But perfect for me. Still, quality. Um, yeah, I'm I'm impressed. I dig it. I will eat the rest of those, and the tzatziki ones. Not sure about the honey butter. Yeah, those. I don't Maybe know. Maybe your kids will try them. At least one of them will try them, and hopefully they'll like them. Yeah. All right. Well, that's all she wrote for this episode. Uh, you already gave them all the fun information about um, where they can find us at themulated.com. So I guess until next time. Let's quit yakking and get back to snacking. Bye. Halloween, the festival of sour.